over the world celebrated Earth Day yesterday. News 8's Brittany Schmidt introduces us to a Viroqua family that treats every day like Earth Day. It's almost May and Wisconsinites are still dealing with snow flurries. And because Wisconsin is known for its brutal winters, a house without a furnace seems unrealistic. But for Sonia Newen House, it's a sign of sustainability. This is probably about 90% more efficient than the average uh, new construction. Sonia, along with her husband and seven-year-old, live in Wisconsin's second official certified passive home. What that means is it's certified to such rigorous energy standards from Germany that the home only needs one hair dryer to heat the house even when it's negative 30 degrees out. This 970-square-foot Viroqua home with three bedrooms and two baths does not have a furnace. So how does it stay warm in the winter? Picture yourself in a duct tape sleeping bag. Um, so this house is full of insulation. We have 18-inch thick walls, 16 inches of uh, dense pack cellulose insulation. We have 12 inches of insulation under the slab, 26 inches of insulation in the attic. The house also has triple pane windows windows, triple pane doors, five and a half inches thick. It's like a vault. And every crease is sealed with a tape made for cold climates. I would bet you a fancy dinner that this is the most well-insulated home in Wisconsin. In fact, the house is so insulated, Sonia actually has to filter fresh air into the house. We have what's called an HRV a heat recovery ventilation unit. So fresh air is delivered into every room and exhausted from the kitchens and bath. But Sonia's idea of sustainability doesn't end with the house. We have an edible landscape plan. In the front, we grow a hedge of Brussels sprouts and cabbage and carrots. She also has a small cabin in the back of the house for storage. The stuga, which is a Swedish word for cabin, stores all of your stuff. We also have a root cellar and a tornado shelter. Sonia's decision to join the small home movement and live in a high-efficient home may not be for everyone. It's just in my blood. But she says even the little things make a difference. We can take action every day. In Viroqua, Brittany Schmidt, News 8. Now, if you would like to tour Sonia's home in Viroqua, we do have her contact information on our website, and you can find us at news8000.com. We've got today's.